Hello, everybody. Joe the Truth Wagner with your friends. Welcome into the Truth Serum, everybody. And folks, has the time flown? Has the time flown? Everybody, all of the conference championship games in college football are now concluded tonight. So everybody, it is time for me to show you my final four. These are my four teams who I think should get in to the college football playoff. So here we go, folks. I'll start at the top and work my way down. The number one ranked team in the land, the Alabama Crimson Tide. Nick Saban does it again with Bama. They defeated Florida in a thrilling game tonight, 52-46 in the SEC Championship game. And everybody else, they blew the doors off of. They blew out. Texas A&M blew them out. LSU ripped them to shreds. Anyone who was in their path, Nick Saban demolished them flat with a steamroller. Their offense is, oh my gosh, is it good. Matt Jones, really good. Showing he's an NFL quarterback prospect. Smith, the wide receiver, is unstoppable. And look at Najee Harris. Five touchdowns in the SEC championship. He might go in the first round as a running back. But anyway, it is clear as day. Alabama, the number one ranked team. Number two. Now, this was a little more difficult, but I'm going to go with the Clemson Tigers. They're the champions of the ACC Conference. They defeated Notre Dame today in their rematch, 34-10. This time they had Trevor Lawrence, and he shined like the superstar he is. Clemson, folks, is really they're really, really good. They're really, really dangerous, explosive NFL bodies everywhere. And think of it, folks, the only loss this year for Clemson, the only loss this year for Clemson was against Notre Dame on the road without their starting quarterback, and it, they went to double overtime and lost by seven. Best loss of anyone in the country this year. They are really good with Trevor Lawrence. They are nearly unbeatable. That's why Clemson is number two. Number three, I'm going to go with the Ohio State Buckeyes, the champions of the Big Ten. They only played six games, but they won them all. They beat two teams ranked in the top 15 when they played them, Indiana and Northwestern today in the Big Ten championship game. Ohio State has been a lot more inconsistent this year than they usually are. But they're 6-0, they ran the table, they have Justin Fields, and all of that talent from that staff and how they're able to recruit, I'd say they're the third best team. And that would set up a rematch of last year's semifinal between Ohio State and Clemson. And now everybody, this is where it gets really interesting. The fourth spot, the fourth spot go a ton of different ways here. You could go with Florida, who just lost close to Bama. Also lost close to Texas A&M. The loss I don't like is to LSU at home. Because of that LSU loss at home, Florida gets crossed off my list. I can't put them here. I can't put them here. Folks, if Florida beat LSU, I put a two-loss Florida in here. I would. But because they lost to LSU at home as a 24-point favorite, I can't do it. I can't do it. Florida, no. So now it comes down to Texas A&M or Notre Dame. Both of them have one loss. A&M's a blowout loss to Bama. Notre Dame's a blowout loss today to Clemson. They are both. They both did not win their conference championship. But here's where I feel the tiebreaker lies, and this is where how I would decide this. Let's look at their best win. Let's look at their best win. 
A&M's best win was over Florida by a field goal. And that was when Florida was ranked, I believe, fifth. Notre Dame's best win is over number one Clemson. I think by the smidgen of the leprechaun shoes of the Fighting Irish, I would put Notre Dame in that fourth and final playoff spot because they have a slightly better best win than A&M. So there you have it, friends. That is my final four. Alabama, Clemson, Ohio State, Notre Dame. Those are my four, and they'll be playing on New Year's Day as part of the college football playoff. The Rose Bowl will be taking place in Arlington. They moved it from Cali. And the Sugar Bowl will be the other matchup. So there it is, friends, if you haven't yet. would really appreciate it if you could click the like button, give it a thumbs up. If you're brand new to the channel, please subscribe, click the sub button, turn that bell on. Because I'll be live for a whole bunch of stuff over the next couple of weeks, friends, so I don't want you to miss it. And folks, who are your final four? Leave it in the chat, leave it in the comments. I'd love to read what you think. And folks, I'll be live in about 12 hours from now when the official final four is revealed. From the Truth Serum, Joey the Truth Wagner signing off. Have a great night.